Hey there, it's Brandon from Virtual DJ, back with another tip of the day. Now, one of the most frequently asked questions that we get in support and on our Facebook page is how to remove the Virtual DJ logo on the video window and replace it with a custom one. Now, there are various methods to display your own logo, but the three that I'll showcase here are all very simple. Here's how to do it. First, let's enable the video engine by clicking on the video tab in the center mixer section of the screen. Right click on the main video out preview window and select what video mode out you wish. Now, by default, Virtual DJ will display the software logo in the upper right hand corner. Now to remove this, go to the settings area and click on the options tab. Now in the search bar, type in logo and the built in logo options will appear. In the video logo option, click no to remove the logo. However, as you can see, I am not logged into an account and since I do not have an active pro license, Virtual DJ is prompting me that a pro license is required to change this option. If you need to purchase a pro license, you can do so by clicking on the license tab in settings or on our buy page at virtualdj.com. Or if you already have a pro license, then log into your account in the license tab in settings to activate. Now that we are logged into our account with a pro license, Virtual DJ will now allow us to remove the software logo back in the options tab. Additionally, the pro license allows us to use our own custom logo in this area. Set the video logo option back to yes and then right below in the video logo image option box, click on the down arrow on the right side and a browser window will appear. Here. Now browse your hard drive to find and locate your custom logo image file and select it. Virtual DJ will now display your custom logo in the video output window. Additionally, this area allows you to change the image size as well as change the placement on the video output screen. Another way to show your logo is to download and use the video logo pad bank. Go to settings extension tab and click on the pad section and enter video in the search bar. The video logo pad bank will now appear. Click on the install button and Virtual DJ will download and install the pad bank. Now exit out of the settings area and on any deck, click on the performance pad selection menu and select the video logo pad bank. Now click on the pad labeled file and a browser window will appear. Use this to browse your computer and select your logo file. Next, click on the pad labeled show and Virtual DJ will now show your video logo on the video output. Additionally, you can use the other pads to make your logo appear larger or smaller, and you can also set the placement in any of the corners of the video output. And finally, you can use the sampler to load an image or video type file to display your logo. Now click on the sampler tab in the side view to show the sampler, and then using your mouse, drag and drop your image or animated video logo file onto a free pad. Now click on the pad to enable the video sampler and show your logo on the video output screen. Now to alter the image settings and have it loop continuously, right click or control click on a Mac and open your logo in the sampler editor. In the sampler editor, you can change the type from a drop to a loop to have the logo loop continuously. And you can also adjust the image size and scale by dragging from the corners or from the image sides. You can then click and drag the image around to reposition where on the video output you want to place it. Additionally, you can alter the transparency of the selected color shown in the color box. Once once finished, click on the save button to save your changes and enable the pad in the sampler to display your logo. As you can see, Virtual DJ makes it simple and easy with different methods to display your brand image in order to self-promote during your mix. That'll do it for this tip of the day. We hope you found it helpful. If you have an idea you'd like to see in our next tip, email tipoftheday at virtualdj.com.